Georgia, honey, I'm jumpy. I'm usually on a case I know what to look for. This time it's blank. I just keep expecting something to happen. Don't apologize. I'm not. I'm trying to win some more out of you. I tell you this, Shell, I don't know an awful lot myself. But I think somebody here may get nervous and jumpy himself when it gets known that I've hired a private detective, that you're working for me on my side, and that you're looking for my sister. And I intend to let it be known before we leave. Just throwing a little weight around, huh? That's about it. Why here? Who's supposed to get nervous? I don't know. You don't know, or you can't tell me? No, I honestly don't know. May I sit with you, querido? Querido, may I sit here? Please do. I'm Lina Royale. Miss Royale, Miss Martin. Miss Martin, Miss Royale. I came over because I wish to apologize. Apologize? For what? For laughing. I should not have laughed at you when you wish to help me. I am appreciative. Six weeks we have done this act, every night, three times, and no one before has ever looked at their fingers even. <laughs> but you looked so funny, I could not help it. But I am sorry now, and thank you. Sure, it's okay. But who are you? What is your name? He's Shell Scott, darling. He's a private detective. It's his business to rescue troubled women. Right now, he's working for me. Is that why you try to help me? Because it is your detective business? Hmm? Well, I didn't stop to think. Foolish habit. Foolish habit. So, you are a detective then? Detective? Who's a detective? Who asked you, friend? You sure are funny out there tonight, Mac. How about coming back tomorrow, Mac? Friend, the name is Scott. Mr. Scott. Don't call me Mac. Okay, Mac. Punch him. Punch him in the nose. For me. You little hellcat, pull in your fangs and put on a brassiere. I will not. I do not like Brazil. Besides, you are fooling with me anyway. Usted y todos sus antepasados son puercos. What did he say? He said you and all your ancestors are pigs. What's going on here? Madre de Dios. Just chatting. Chatting my ass. I'm Maggie. I own the joint, and I asked you, what's going on? You're the owner? Yeah, I'm Mrs. Ramos. What's the beef? Perhaps I can explain. My name is Georgia Martin. My sister, Tracy, didn't come home last night. She's missing. This is Mr. Scott, a private detective I've engaged to help me find her. I got religion and suggested to Mr. Scott that we come here to start with. Mr. Scott and Mr. Mercado aren't getting along. What the hell? Chicken, you talk like you're looped. You been drinking the cactus juice? Look, Mac, I like everybody to have a good time in my place here. But leave us not be busting anybody, huh? At least not in here. Bad for business. Besides, that's my knife. Wouldn't want nothing to happen to that wing of his. Might make him stick Sweetie Puss in the gizzard. Huh? Huh, Sweetie Puss? Mrs. Remorse, sorry if I caused any disturbance. This shiv artist got in my hair. Take him away and bury him someplace. Stick him in a drawer. No more trouble. Good old Mac. Miguel, scram. So that's the boss. She's real cute. A mess. What mess she is. She stinks. I have to get ready for the next show. Will you see me? Uh-uh. Not right away. But you will come back, querido. What sort of play are you giving this? I may not be the world's best detective, but from where I sit, this party smells like amateur all over it. Everything's fine. Just right. What the hell, honey? You think this kind of junk's going to get anyone jumpy or nervous? Like you said? Yes, I do, Shell. I scared somebody. You're off the trolley. Who, for instance? Nobody I saw looks scared to me. I don't know who, but I'll bet I scared somebody. Damn! You're the don't-knowingest woman I ever saw. Okay, Georgia, your party. If you're through here, what's next? Come on. We might as well leave. <laughs>